Masih bersama saya Didi Sulaiman dalam berita sukan. Okey berita seterusnya. PNFC hari ini berjaya mengekalkan keputusan kemenangan terhadap PHFC setelah isu jaringan gol itu dibawa ke jawatan kuasa pengadilan FIFA. Dalam perlawanan antara kedua-dua pasukan, PHFC mendakwa telah menjaringkan 2 gol berbanding 1 gol dari PNFC. Pengadil perlawanan Abdullah bin Ahmad berkata dua gol PHFC itu dijaringkan selepas wisil penamat dan ketika PNFC sedang meraihkan kemenangan. Hasnul, betul ke beritanya? Betul. Oh, tu ada orang ni. Pengadil Abdullah bin Ahmad memberitahu pengurusan PNFC yang jaringan pasukan itu yang disaksikan ribuan penonton adalah tidak sah lantas pengurusan PHFC melancarkan jelajah seluruh negara sebagai protes untuk menuntut kemenangan dari PNFC. Mari kita saksikan cuplikan video kekecohan perlawanan itu minggu lepas. Naib Presiden PKR Tian Chua ditampak dan dibaling botol minuman penyokong parti berkenaan dalam kejadian di Pejabat PKR Petaling Jaya sebentar tadi. Penyokong parti berkenaan dipercayai tidak puas hati kepada Tian Chua yang dilihat cenderung kepada kem bekas Timbalan Presiden PKR Datuk Seri Mohamed Azmin Ali selain menjerit pengkhianat kepadanya ketika Asnur. mahu meninggalkan Pejabat Petaling selepas mesyuarat. Asnur, stop! Video politik lah tu! Stop! Aku salah! Aku salah! Aku salah! Aku salah. Oh jangan nangis! Oh jangan nangis! Ah, uh, okey itu dah tadi uh, sedikit cuplikan video yang dicuplik uh, daripada tempat kejadian. Ah, uh, terus Wabi Sadik dah online. Wabi Sadik dah online. Wabi Sadik dah dah online. Ya, yeah, kau sambunglah. Mai Nisha. Nisha Bera, kalau dia berak lama. Ya, oh, berak pula dah. Betul lah, aku nak buat. Kaulah. Aku pun tak politik. Hantam sajalah. Astagfirullahalazim. Cepat cepat tak sempat. Oi, cepat cepat. Ah. Uh, ah, uh, okey. Uh, untuk seterusnya Uh, saya dapat info yang uh, YB Syed Sadiq sedang berada di talian uh, Untuk Ui, macam mana ni? Uh, untuk menerangkan uh, mengapa Mengapa? PH Tumbang uh, Mengapa kerajaan PH Tumbang uh, Okey, uh, tu dia Okey, jadi uh, YB terima kasih kerana sudi bersama kami di Ampang Waterfront uh, Maaf saya lupa yang YB dalam skrin TV Okey, jadi YB, apa yang berlaku sebenarnya YB? Mengapa PH Tumbang YB? Silakan jawab It came to this because of the formation of an illegitimate uh, backdoor government. Bas, bas, the fact bas, that bas, bas. Um, we doubt Dr. Mahadeh's knowledge that uh, his own colleagues Man, decided to work together with the well-known global kleptocrats to form a backdoor government and to take down the democratically elected Pakatan Harapan government. I think it's a truly a sad day for Malaysian democracy. Uh, YB, but there's obviously a lot of a concern about the legitimacy about this new government you call a backdoor government. Lacking in a legitimacy or wasn't elected by the people. Uh, the Guardian newspaper in the UK, for example, called King decision to name Tan Sri Muhyiddin Yassin as a Prime Minister a royal coup. Is that the description that you agree with? I think it's unfair to blame the Malaysian king. The reality is, the leaders who currently claim government came in, came in in the wrong fashion. Wait, wait, wait. What do you mean a wrong fashion? You mean like this? Or like this? Or like this? Absolutely not. Ah, okay, continue. Came in, came in in the wrong fashion, where they presented the wrong numbers to the Malaysian king. Oh, oh, wait, 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 wait. Sorry, 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 sorry. Hello? Sob lagi? <laughs> Hah? Wak kartu? <laughs> eh. Orang ini uang sejeningnya wak kartu kan gini? Hah? Salah nomor? Yo! <laughs> Sorry YB, it's the wrong number. What's the coincidence? You are talking about the wrong number, suddenly a wrong guy called me. Oh my god. Continue, continue. I think it's, it's just wrong for their side to claim that Dr. Mahadi was the architect of this move and that's exactly what they wanted to do. Yeah, all people know Mahadi is the doctor, not an architect. What's your problem? What's the problem? What's in the world of Disney you talking about, Sheikh Sadeh? In reality, that is not the case. Yeah, continue, continue, continue. Up to you, up to you. He is like a father to me. One of the reasons why I joined politics was because of him. 
He was one of the persons who spoke up against the global kleptocrats, who was sacked by his party for speaking up against the global kleptocrats. I joined his party as one of the co-founders. My mother was threatened. She was a teacher and she was threatened by the government then. I lost my job, Mandy, as a researcher and as a lecturer. My whole family was threatened. So much money was awarded to me if I decided to join the global kleptocrats then. What truly disappoints me is that today, my very own leader, my father, decided to open the door of Malaysian government and democracy to the same global kleptocrats who threatened me, my family, who sacked him and threatened his family and now are aligning himself. Okay, Abby, this is just my opinion. You are a very intelligent, smart, good young guy. Aww. But unfortunately, you are following the wrong shape. That's just my opinion. Okay, no offense. Thank you. Okay, Abby. Terima kasih kerana bersama kami pada hari ini. Thank you very much, Lily. Masih tak nak cakap bahasa Melayu. <laughs> okay, uh, jadi kita... Eh, hey, kau akan pesan nangis? Ha? Weh, laju kau lari. Sambil nangis buat tu. Eh, semenjak tak dapat berkhidmat bersama rakyat ni. Macam.